want to talk about Smile Direct. Now, I'm super happy so far with my results. I'm two and two months and almost one week in, and um, I really, I'm starting to really get used to it. I've made some mistakes. I've thrown them away by accident. I had to dig in the garbage and get them back, wash them, put them back in. I've done so many things. Like I, I'm really happy with them. They're just like sometimes they hurt, and I'm just like, ugh. But you just have to like grin and bear it. Like you have to just stick through it. For people who feel like they are not gonna keep up with it because they're able to take it in and out, trust me. If you want the results and you know you're paying for it, you're gonna do it because I felt the same way. I'm not very disciplined with stuff like that, and I feel like I've been keeping up with them pretty well. My lisp has been <laughs> like times 10 now <laughs> because they're in there and I'm very conscious that they're in there and it just makes it very noticeable now because I feel like I was told, my best friend told me that I did have a lisp but I didn't want to believe it but I noticed and then when I put these in, it's times 10. So I'm just getting used to talking with it still I don't think you'll ever get really used to talking with it you just get used to them being there um, but this is pretty much how my smile looks right now the gap is going to be closed not gap but it's not really it's an overbite now but for it's not an overbite or an underbite they have another name for it and I cannot remember what the name was but that's what I have <laughs> and it's looking pretty well as you can see some of the as you can see some of the pieces here like you can see a little bit of it of the clear part because once it's done then it'll fit completely but right now it's slowly pulling the teeth into the position that they are supposed to go and sometimes I find myself making them tighter pull them in pushing them up on my tongue pushing them down my tongue and just to kind of like speed up the process but I don't think you're really supposed to do that but I can't help them because they're in there and I'm conscious about them and it's just gonna happen and um I feel like they're moving super duper fast versus like metal braces where people have them in for like a year or two years I'm not pretty sure I feel like maybe that's a way for them to make their money because you have to keep coming in and get tightened and stuff like that but um with Smile Direct, you get everything in one. So my plan was five months, 15 um, aligners, and I am on number seven. And I have a week with these. It is now Monday, and I will be switching them out come Sunday for the next one, that's another week. And then the third one for the month will be for the last two weeks of the month. So you do three aligners a month for five months, that's 15, right? So I am super happy to be past the halfway mark and I am going to have straight teeth by December January and I'm super excited about that because I have been dealing with this insecurity for so long and I am so excited for it to be gone I mean I have to think about it and I'm be walking like this walking around just like this how are you doing how y'all doing today what's going on with y'all today huh how y'all doing how's everything you know <laughs> And we're gonna think I'm super happy and something's wrong with me or super prissy or whatever. But that is okay because mom paid for these and <laughs> I look bomb and I don't know how to act. <laughs> so I'm gonna be smiling forever after this. But <laughs> I'm super happy with them. I wanna show you how easy they are. Um, they give you a little tool to take them out, but I don't even use them anymore. I do use the little holder that it comes in. It has a mirror attached to it, so you're able to see as you put them in. I don't use the mirror. I haven't used the mirror since I've done it. I probably flipped it open once or twice just to make use of it. But it's good to have. I'll probably keep it even after this. Um, mostly because I have the retainers, but I don't use the tool anymore. I just use the holder to put it in when I'm eating and things like that. Because when I do not use the holder, that's when things like me throwing it away happens. And we don't want that. So make use of the holder that they give you, the case, for your liners because it's very um, I've almost lost them like twice, but um, I've learned 
to really keep track of it. Put them right back in with them done. So, this is what it looks like. I just pull it down on the inside, on the corners, all the way in the back, and with my nail. Um, we don't have nails then. You probably need a tool. <laughs> And when you take them out, wash them off. Mm. I know it's super gross. Um, <laughs> um, this is how my teeth look without. Now my smile looks slightly different when the liners are out versus when they're in because they're trying to shift them into the position that they're supposed to go in for the next aligners. So this is how it looks when my aligners are out. Slightly bigger. That's okay. Super easy to put in. I know you're supposed to put them in like each aligner one by one, click it in, but I like to bite down. That gets the job done much faster. Cause don't nobody got time for anything else. So I just put them in. Bite down. Ooh, that one hurt. Because I'm still gonna use these ones because they're fresh, they're new. For the first two or three days, you're gonna feel a lot of discomfort. But you get used to it after a while, you just have to ignore it. I like to put my eyeliners in that night when I'm gonna go to sleep. So much easier that way because I'm gonna feel uncomfortable and I'm just gonna be like, oh my god, these hurt. These are so tight. <laughs> when they're loose, that's how you know it's time to change them. And they also send you a text message each time it's time to change. If you are behind and maybe you forgot you slept two nights in a row without your eyeliners, you can set your schedule to put two days back since you've missed two days worth. Um, I've missed two days. Um, that's the only amount of time I'm allowing myself to be behind because I gotta be on the ball because I need this to be straight. By 2021, baby. Period. <laughs> Feeling good. I'm very happy with it. I do think that this is very worth it. It's purchase. And it comes with a writing kit, so. <laughs> um, I'm very happy. I give them A plus plus, 10 out of 10. And that is two months in. So I will give you a review when it's probably in another two months or when everything is done. Um <clears throat> I'm happy with them. Get smaller, right? It'll be the best thing we've ever done, and you get to save a hell of a lot of money. Period. Yeah, I only pay like seventy-six dollars a month. The best seventy-six dollars a month of my life. <laughs> Woo! So I'm wanting to do this forever. Ah, I'm so happy with it. Eight plus plus. You can't beat that. Ten out of ten. <laughs> you better get you some smaller. Thanks for watching guys, stay tuned for the next update, when the bad boy is, is straight. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe, subscribe, you know you want to.